Ladies and gentlemen, the battle for 2024 is only getting fierce and Republic is on the campaign trail. This time with Rashtriya Lokdal Chief Jayant Chaudhary. In a conversation with Republic TV, he's hit out at his ex-ally Samajwadi Party saying it used to give up the queen and take away the king. In fact, this is for the first time Jayant Chaudhary openly talks about the Indi alliance and why exactly he decided to shift allegiance and more importantly, join along with the Bharatiya Janta Party. Listen in to what Jayant Chaudhary had to say. Political parties are all out and campaigning on field. Election mood is electric and enthusiasm in high. Right now we are in the election rut. My first question to you. Was it possible 2014-19 Sanjeev Balyan has won in this jarred belt? What, what led this shift of yours? Two years back you campaigned here in different election rut with Akhilesh Yadav. Today you are here with Sanjeev Balyan. Listen, po politics is not about personal likes, dislikes and equations. Of course it helps if at the highest level there is a good camaraderie and emotional connect but you're doing politics for issues. What are the issues that are important for the grassroots? Looking at the well-being of the country, looking at the direction of the country, looking at the uh, historic mandate that BGP is seeking, the way it's engaging with its alliances, the way it's expanding its footprint across the country, it was pretty clear for any political observer that BGP is gaining traction, NDA is gaining strength. Given that circumstance, it was important that RLD and in particular Western Uttar Pradesh, farmers and young people of this region, women of this region, have a stake in the, in the mainstream. Which is why we've taken the decision. We made a new alliance. It's a, it's a new alliance, but it's a partner who we've worked with in the past. You are the torch bearer of RLD. Your thoughts are entrenched with the farmers community. Was it easy to come and alliance with NDA? Because there were, there were several questions which were being raised when you came and have an, had an alliance with NDA. See, comfort takes time. Even at the grassroots, you know, people who have been managing the booth and who's seen, who've been looking at each other as political opponents through for a long time, takes time for them to adjust to each other, to, to you know, understand that we are both working for mutual benefit. But at the end of the day, alliances are made to benefit yourself. But if you're not giving anything to the other party, the other party is not going to want to align with you. Therefore, I appeal to all RLD workers to put aside their personal differences in the larger interest. We must honestly abide by the decision that has been taken and strengthen NDA. I understand there could be disagreements with uh, Akhilesh Yadav or an Indi alliance. But what exactly took you to take this sudden decision? Was it after Bharat Ratna or you were already, you know, thinking about it after the two meetings of INDA? People of Muzaffarnagar know exactly what the reason was why I uh, broke the alliance with Samajwadi. I think that's all that needs to be said on that issue. One more thing, continuously Samajwadi Party's leaders are stating that this is not a natural alliance. Eventually, Jain Chaudhary will come back and return to its own party and return to the alliance with Samajwadi Party. Akhilesh Yadav also recently took a pot shot at you. How would you like to respond to everything? It is an election time. People say these things. It's not getting under my skin. I am very clear. I have clarity in my decision making. And I take into account what is going to happen, what I perceive is going to happen in the near term, medium term future, which is why I have taken this decision. It is for the Samajwadi to come and campaign. They have not even started the campaign. Today, in one day, I have touched three Lok Sabhas. Right now, we are Muzaffarnagar. Before this, I was in Kairana. In the end of the day, by night, I will be in Bijnor Parliament. Till now, only seven days left to campaigning. Not one program has been done by India. So that India alliance appears to be on paper, nowhere on the ground. Thank you. One last que question to you, Jayanji. One last question. So what are you bringing in plate for uh, Sanjeev Balyan? Are you assured and how confident are you of this victory? Our voters are very, very, they understand the equation. They've understood exactly the reasons for me taking the decision. And they're very honestly putting all their efforts towards ensuring a win, a big win in Muzaffarnagar. Thank you. So
दिस इज जैन चौधरी स्पीकिंग एक्सक्लूसिवली टू रिपब्लिक एज दिस इज द इलेक्शन रथ ऑफ जैन चौधरी एंड संजीव बालियान एंड दिस रथ इज मेड इन अ वे दैट दे आर कैंपेनिंग इन दिस इलेक्शन रथ ओनली एंड मीटिंग द पब्लिक एंड सिटीजन ऑफ मुजफ्फरनगर राइट नाउ वी आर फॉलोइंग जैन चौधरी एज दिस इज अ कैंपेन ट्रेल स्पेशल ब्रॉडकास्ट इलेक्शन ब्रॉडकास्ट वे जैन चौधरी इज वेरी कॉन्फिडेंट दैट संजीव बालियान इज गोइंग टू रिटेन द सीट ऑफ मुजफ्फरनगर वंस अगेन Well that's all that we could pack it this edition of uh, this is exclusive